Hey everybody, welcome back to MVM Live today on a special Friday. We had special Friday. We had a few things happen this week that just kept pushing it back, but it did happen. It's called Special Friday, not Migraine Wednesday. Yeah, not Migraine Wednesday. Also, today is Friday the 13th, so of course anything oh, that can it? go I wrong would happen. Yeah. Yeah. So You're not going to watch the movies tonight or anything? We'll, we'll see if anything goes wrong with the stream. I mean, it usually does. Maybe Friday 13 is our... Friday Lucky number. Is our sweet spot. Well, I just realized as I was driving over here, I was like, "Oh man, we could have streamed Friday the Thirteenth, the board game. Maybe, maybe next Friday the Thirteenth, we'll do that." Is there a Friday the Thirteenth? There's the. Talking I'm talking about last Friday. Uh, Wait, I mean, it's not really IP, sure. but it, it's it's Friday the Thirteenth. I don't know if that would be an exciting one to watch. Maybe because it's just you sitting there thinking like, "Who's oh, it going to be here?" Especially two players. I'm not <laughs> sure. Anyway, so, today anyway. we're not playing last Friday. We are playing. Clank. Oh, David, you're quiet again. Maybe it's I'm, just that I'm so well, loud. Here, here's what it is. I come in and sit down. Now I'm not quiet, am I? It's because Mr. Microphone is right here. See, now Ryan's doubly Hello. loud. I'm doubly loud. Professional Happens. Professional streaming, everyone. Hey, sometimes you forget to put the... I've had an entire video. We recorded an entire video. Where I forgot to put the microphone on for the entire video. Whoa. So what happens? Did I edit that one or did you? Yeah. I hope you did. <laughs> Loopy says, what mic? You don't... What? I All right. Well, mic. hopefully... I project. Hopefully that fixed the volume issues. But yeah, yes, I'm sure it, I'm, I'm sure it fixed it. Today we're playing Clank Catacombs. You may have seen our Just Played, where we talk a little bit about it. This is coming out. I think people that were at PAX or maybe some other cons already have it. Or maybe you ordered it from their website. I don't know if it's actually out in retail yet. Yeah, I don't know if it is. I, haven't, I mean, I haven't seen it locally. Um, but if it's not, I believe it is on the precipice Soon. of coming out. So I'm a huge Clank fan. So I'm really excited. I, I love... What they've done with Clank Catacombs, you'll see what makes this game different as we play. You can also go watch our Just Played video where we talk a little bit more in detail about our thoughts. Today we're just going to play it. Um, David, you're not as, like, you don't have as much history with Clank as I do. I mean, I have some history with Clank. Uh, I'm not maybe as big of a fan as what you just described yourself <laughs> to be. Uh, but I like Clank quite a bit. But it is one of those games where, you know, a lot of other things have come since. Sure. This is one of the early ones that took deck building and kind of added to it uh, and now we've seen so many other things that took duck building and combined with other things but this one as we said in our other video uh, feels to me like the way to play clank sure and you'll see why you'll see why pretty much immediately so let's just let's just jump right let's into it let's just play i'm let's going just play. to you guys can, can kind of see you'll notice some stuff that you've seen with clank so we've got all of this the maintenance stuff over here the cards that we can buy our health trackers the market and this deck of tiles, because there's no game board, this is all we start with, is this one little crypt board here. And we're going to be exploring off of that, like in normal Clank, by playing cards that let us move and do other things. But that reveal is what it's all about. How many cards do we draw, Ryan? Five. Uh, Tristan says he pre they pre-ordered two copies of this version. Oh, and have had it for a month. Oh. So I think pre-orders must there have gone go. out. I think pre-orders probably went out around the same time that the like packs release. Sure. Um, but wide retail, I don't, I don't know what the wide retail is. Yeah, I have, we right. saw some so, comments on our other video. People saying, "I can't wait to get mine." Yeah, uh, I think it just depends. Like it, maybe not everywhere. Where you yeah. are in the world and things like that. Hopefully, you've been playing it, Tristan. All right, so let's just jump right in. As you know, you draw a hand of cards, you play all those cards, and each card has an effect. You have to play every card in your hand. You can't just leave them. Some of the cards are bad, like this stumble. So I get to add one clank into the clank pool. And I only have one movement this round. They kind of um, start your decks. You've got two move in your starting deck, so it's enough. We'll both get to the crystal cave before our second turn is over. But I do have four total to buy with. Um... Trash up the two burgles from your play area. Oh, that might not be a bad one to start with just to get it rid of them right away. Or I could buy that sudden movement and get two moves. That feels pretty good, too. Now, the arrive cards don't do anything at the beginning. Not at of the, the beginning game, right? of the game. Uh, actually, I think I want this remove traps for two. That costs two. This is going to give me some combat. Is it replaced immediately? No, not till the end. And I've got two more to spend. I don't think there's anything else an that's explore. too let's just get an explore you read my mind i'm a mind reader and that's it that's basically a turn i at the beginning of the game like with most deck builders we're kind of building into a better deck and we're starting with a pretty limited deck to begin with i'm going to play in this space too so people can see my cards i've got two stumbles so i have to add 
two clank. Yep, which means I'll have another one. Um, and then I've got a sidestep and two burgles. All right, I'll move you in. There's so only I'm one path right now. Move into there, and I am going to buy. There's not much. Mm. Ooh, uh, you know what? Oh yeah, explorers. David, get... you met mercenary. Mercenary is the one that's two. See, look, people in the comments are watching. Oh, I was looking. I was looking. At uh, what it generated. I was looking at what it generated. My bad. No, it's okay. Uh, I am going to get flamboyance for two, actually. Oh, did this dragon... Did you replace this card with a dragon card? I did. Oh, you should have done... To, you're going to have to pay attention I was, to I, Yeah. I'm normally so the one that does the cards. what happens replace with a dragon? The dragon attacks. Oh, so should I even go on? I mean, it's not going to change anything. So what do I do? Put all the cubes in the bank. Does the dragon move at all? Uh, No. I love all the pos Wait, positivity. Uh, I get to add a, a clink. There right should here. be. Okay. 25, I think, I is the number. Three? Shake it up really good, and then pull three. Come on, shake it up. Give me five, about 15 minutes more. Matt, I wasn't even the one that suggested that card. David did. I was just going along with it. How many? Three? Three. That's not good. No. How about a red? How oh! About two, yellow? two yellow, but that that's most of your yellow. You only have three in there, so they... Those two well, yellow, go those up there. Two yellow go up there. More and the black one just more. gets removed out of the game. Out of the game. All right, now I will replace this card that I And want. if it's another dragon, it attacks again. It's not. So I just got, I did my turn. I took flamboyance. It's going to my discard. Ooh, divining rod. The end. If you generate six or more by power or whatever it's called, you get a heart. All right, well, there's my second stumble because we all start with two. So there we go. If you want to put that in the... I will. And then I get one more move, so I'm in the crystal cave now. You always have to stop in a crystal cave. Not like it matters. I only have one movement anyway. Uh, and then I only have three to mm. buy with. So I think I'm going to do that sudden movement. That seems pretty good. All right. Let's see what replaces my sudden movement. And all these cards go in to the discard pile. Swindle. Ooh. Just get you money. It's not bad. I mean, money is hard to come by in this game. That is not bad. Loopy, that's a good point. There are some powers and some cards that let you bypass or like move through crystal caves. We don't have any yet. Hmm. Casey said this seems to be the definitive clank. Are you saying that, Casey, because you watched our video? Because we said the same thing. It is the definitive clank. I, I, would, I would agree with I'm gonna that. I'm going to make this easy. I've got a whole bunch of burgles Ooh. and a scramble. So I'm going to move one to the crystal cave yep. just like you. Uh, and then I've got one, two, three, four, five to spend. That's a way better hand than mine. It is not bad. No, that's I'm not bad at for all. A three and a two. Well, you've got your swindle. That's only three. That's out. You know what? You I could get a swindle or mercenary. I think I'm gonna take the swindle. And oh, the that's funny, then, Casey, because we like that is literally. I think we said the exact same thing. Like this is the definitive clink. Yeah, I, I feel like this is the version that you'll want to play if you can get a hold of it. And Tristan, we said <laughs> Tristan on the nose too. I, I, that's that's what I'm most looking forward to is that the number of tiles they could add to this through expansions. Oh yeah, this one is utterly more expandable than this the original. This is awful. Or, or more easily expandable. Look at this, two stumbles. Ooh, so I, I'm familiar with that hand. One move and only two by power. Now the move though, I can come off of either one of these paths but before I decide where I'm going to go, I get to look at the next tile. This is the part that makes the game for me, is flipping this over and determining oh, what we're going to be. Tile before you... Well, you oh, have okay. to because you get, you get to place I it. I don't get to decide, like, oh, I'm going to move it over here instead. Oh, okay. But I can decide not to move or which direction I want to move. Oh, okay. You can decide not to I move? I could decide not to move. Really? Yeah. I could get a minor seeker here for taking a damage or I could just make us both move into this one room. And in this version too, like these little spots here that have the question mark, you don't actually necessarily fill those. You can yeah. just grab them because they're always generating. I am going to take this damage. Can you add that to the damage track? I can. To get a minor secret. We have these minor secrets off of the side of the game board. Mine is a hot dragon egg. So I'll get three victory points at the end of the game, but the dragon does get angry. He moves up on the track. Oh, that pesky dragon. I would have rather had something else. And I only have two to buy from. Uh, how about that pillage? That seems pretty good. 
Oh, if you generate three gold this turn, draw a card. That would have been great with the one that you took. Hmm. What's out? Two skeletons now. Two skeletons. Is it my turn? It is your turn. So you're going to have some choices here, David. All right. Well, I've got my swindle. So I'm going to get three coins, please. Yeah, that's so good. I mean, it's not bad. Not huh. bad. Um, and then I've got one sidestep. <clears throat> Looks like David is cheering for the dragon, actually. So I'm going to move down here. Oh, you're because. going the other way. I want to split up. I don't want to be <laughs> near you, Ryan. <coughs> Excuse me. Ryan coughs too much. I'm just getting I'm over. I'm going to get into a different room. Uh, mm -hmm. And then three buy power. Um, I think I will get an explorer. Okay, so I've this is a much better hand, but I only have one scramble. So I'm only going to move one space no matter what, so I might as well move into this crystal cave. This crystal cave heals me for one health. Just so I basically got those three points for free. So I guess that's not the end of the world. Not too bad. I have removed traps, which lets me replace a card in the dungeon row. So, uh, and I have five to buy with. Let's replace, I don't even know what I want to replace. The white, um, the, the white tourmaline? Yeah, actually that is the one. Let's get rid of that. I can defeat those skeletons Chaos. and get some gold. Trash this card. Oh, but it gives you three for one. One time. Yeah. All right, so I've got uh, five to buy with. I want to take this charlatan for four. I think that's and it. Payoff. Oh, and the payoff for one. Yeah, perfect. And then I have two to attack with. So I could get both of those skeletons for four gold, but I'm adding two clank. That seems dangerous. That seems really dangerous I mean, to add Clank. It depends on what kind of adventurer you are, Ryan. I'll just defeat that goblin and get one well, coin instead. I think instead. we all know what kind of adventurer Ryan is. The one that hides from the monsters. So you got your money? Yeah. I've had too many experiences dying in this game. When we last played, that's what happened, I believe, right? Uh, deadpan, I mean, you could just blind place. All the tiles will work out, but the fun of the game for me is is arranging it and trying to create the path that works best for you. All right. Unfortunately, I'm going to start off with two stumbles. I don't right, like the too. amount of clank that I'm putting in the bag. That's um, how I feel. And then I've just got two burgles. All right. Did you notice that you put up two dragons, David? I didn't. So before you do any of that, we have to do a dragon attack. And it doesn't matter how many you put out. It doesn't matter how many you put one. out. It's just one dragon attack. You're going to draw three. So... I'm going to draw them all at once here, Ryan. Yeah, let's see what happens. Oh! Yeah, well, it's bound to happen. That's a good draw. I like to see that, everybody. Now we're tied up. We are tied up. Oh, David, you just... Yeah, the cubes that you just put out for these stumbles shouldn't have been put in there. But I didn't... Uh, did I put... Oh, them? I don't think you even put them out yet. Because there was only three red cubes up there, right? Or no. There was three red and two yellow up there. It doesn't matter. They'll get added into the bag. There's quite a bit anyway. of yellow in there, so I do think yeah. we'll have to rewind it. If I did, I did. If I did, they'll I get added see. in. I mean, you're right, but um, they didn't get drawn anyway. Oh yeah, I did do it. Yeah, I it's did fine. Do it. So then I have um, two. And Are you three. gonna get the four clank? I am. Okay. Here, give me and one of that. Here's dollars. five gold for you. Give me one back. Make some change. I mean, you're a little bit more adventurous than I am, I guess. Um, and then I've got three to buy. I'm going to get an explorer. Yeah. Yes. All right. Let's see what we got. Let's see if there's more dragons out. You've got the rebel paladin. Ooh, that sounds fun. And the skeletal ape. Wow, defeat. Three buy power, three coins, and plus three clank. Oh boy. If you have another companion in your player, draw a card. If you have an artifact, draw a card. Oh, I like that paladin. And I can't afford him. So, sudden movement gets me two moves. Mercenary gets me two attacks. And I have a total of five buys. So I'm going to use those two moves. So I have to follow the arrows. I can either follow through, go David's direction. Stay out of my room. Or I could come this way and go down or over. I'm going to go over here. Got it? Yeah. 
By the way, these light purple tiles that we're flipping, these represent sort of the safe space uh, that you need to be in at, towards the end of the game if yeah. you want to get out alive. I think I'm going to do this and get the coin. All right. Yeah. I've got two coins. Uh, two attack power. I'll fight the goblin again and get one coin. And then with my five buy, I'll just I'll get this rebel paladin. That seems too good to to waste. Oh, dragon before Ryan goes because the skeletal eight. Oh, d sure. I didn't even see that was on there. We keep missing it. It is. I know, I'm used to turning out the cards, he, he so the I'm not even really looking at them. I promise we won't miss another. Can you promise it's that? It's a guarantee. Can How many you? do we draw now? Three again? Three still. Okay, this one feels less good. Oh, is that four? No, it's three. So David's cubes would have gone in there now anyway. Another one of mine? It looks like another one of yours. All right, so replace it and look for the dragon symbol. Is it a dragon? No, it is not. It is an ogre merchant. Uh, it also has a dragon symbol on oh, it. Oh, there is a dragon. You I, almost I was looking, missed. I was looking here. You almost missed the first one after saying you wouldn't miss another I know, one. I know. It's, yeah, the big bright dragon symbol. So still, only three. And I don't know if I have any more in there, do I? Yes. I guess. Oh my gosh. I guess I do. I oh don't... my god. Now you might not. Ryan's crying. <laughs> yeah. Ryan, you need some healing. Yeah, well, I'm trying to get seven gold so I can buy Is it my that healing now? potion over there. Yeah. Because you went, right? Yeah, I just went and explored this tile over here. Okay. All right, I'm going to play Flamboyance. Okay. I get to draw a card. Nice. Oh, if you make two or more Clank this turn, it's plus two. Nice. Indeed. Are you going to make two Clank? I am not. I've got two movement and uh, what's this called? Purchase power? Yeah, I, I don't remember what the term for it is. That's really bad. Oh, I've got, an, I got three movement. Okay, so things are happening. Um, so I am going to move off of this side of the board here. Okay. Um, oh, yeah. So we'll show you something. This is going to take an extra movement, yep. right? So two movement to so go in there. Two movement to go in there. And then this is a new symbol representing people. Yeah, it's like a jail. Save, right? It's like a prison in the dungeons of the catacombs. And it yeah. just takes one of my lockpicks. just picks. takes one lockpick. So I'm going to spend one of my lockpicks. Put, put it right on there to know that oh, it, that's right. they've already been rescued. They can't be rescued again. And you get two people that you've rescued. This so that's just two victory two points. points. And then this, which is one of the little monkey idols. It counts idol as faces, a monkey idol, which gives you three, three points. points. So if you have another card that wants you to have a monkey idol, that actually counts. And I still have one movement, right? You still do. Um, you could go down or over. Uh, we're going to run out of space. I'm going to go... Uh, I'm going to go over. Yeah, Brian, you have to choose where to go before revealing the tile, but then like... For example, if it has multiple paths off of it, like this one did, you can choose which way to go after you, uh, or like which which orientation to choose from. So you're moving across, damage, so you right? take a damage. Yep. And then you have your buy power. And my buy power was one, two, three, four, five. Um, oh, you can get some of that good stuff. You can get that rose quartz. Now this minus two clank, that's only if there's some sitting up yeah, there, Yeah, right? and you get plus two clank when you buy it. Oh. <laughs> I know. It's dangerous. All the gems are like that. They give you plus two clank. I will buy the smoky quartz. Okay, so that's going to be plus two clank. Yep. And replace it. Let's look for the dragon. Is it a dragon? It is not. I can 100% confirm. Ooh, a flaming confirm, skull. But it is a floating skull. You have a crown, teleport to an adjacent room. And when you acquire it, you teleport to an adjacent room. Oh, I don't have six to buy here. All right, so I have one. I have our two moves. And I have three, four, five to buy with. So if I can get, if you generate at least three gold this turn, draw a card. Okay. Maybe I can make that happen. I'm going to move down here. So this is our first non-depths tile, which could be bad for me. So also, this is our first artifact. 
So we're going to take the mm -hmm. top artifact from the deck or the thing and put it there. And that's five dollars or five points. Sorry. I can't really get to it very easily. I'm going to move into here. I'm going to use my lock pick to get a major secret and hope that maybe it's nice. gold. It's not. It's a map. See, I don't actually know what this map is. That's why I have this one. Oh, oh, keep this token for the rest of the game. You may go the opposite way through one-way tunnels. Nice. Always? Always. And it's forever? a map. Dang. Always and, and five forever. Points? That's crazy. Well, I feel good for that one. It's not a one-time use it's and you not. get rid of it? Keep this token for the rest of the game, it says. Wow. Okay, what else? However, I can't draw three. I can't get three gold because I only have two attack. If, I, if only I had one more. All right, that's fine. Uh, I used one of my moves. I've got two more. I'm going to come back this way. Maybe I can get... Ooh. This is a ghost tile. We found our first ghost. So, you put a white cube in the pool. That's bad. I mean, it's not good. I'm going to come down here. I'm going to rescue these prisoners. And maybe one of them will give me either a gold or a combat here. Two combat. If I have... Oh, if I have two tomes at the end of the game, it's five points. I don't know that I'll have two tomes. So I have two, three, four combat. If you want. I do want. Uh, so I can defeat this ogre merchant. Gain five gold. So I'll do that. And I will gain five gold. So he goes away. And I gained at least three gold this turn. So I get to draw a card. Which gave me two more combat. So I had four. And that guy was four. So I'll use this two to kill that goblin and get one more. I can replace a card in the dungeon row. Let's get rid of that skeletal ape. I don't like that. And I have one, two, three, four, five, six to buy with. Rebel Scribe. If you have another companion to play, you draw a card. Um, he could be a friend for your paladin. This lets me teleport to an adjacent room. I could just teleport over here. Yeah, does that when mean you an unrevealed room? It can be, or you can reveal the room, just like mm. moving. Anytime you would move. Really? And yep. then just randomly go into, like, the treasure room of all treasures? Well, we'll see. It's not, but... Yeah, but, I mean, you could. I could go get a seven-point artifact. Or I could go to the way shrine. Hmm. Um, I'm going to go to the way shrine. I don't think I want a seven point artifact. So I'll put my little thing there and I'll take my money for doing so. Oh, actually, yeah, adjacent room. It would only be here. Oh, adjacent room. You're right, not adjacent tile. You you're right. Oh, you're right, adjacent room. Oh, that doesn't even connect to that, does it? No. So I have to flip another tile. What about this? It's not even, it won't ever be adjacent. Because you. Adjacent just means connected by a line. Oh, okay. So if it's another really? ghost Surprise, tile, that's how this. Uh, we have to yeah, look I mean, this look up and see if this card works this way because this seems crazy. This room, these two rooms are adjacent. I know, but you had two tiles. I'm just wondering. Could if have it, been. I mean, it could it have been. Could have been four. Like if you're move, if I was making this move normally, and I trace this path to nothing, I have to reveal another tile. You can't just stop in a non. You know what I mean? Indeed. Like as you're following this path, it's it's strange. That this one bypassed these rooms completely, but that's bad luck. I'm just wondering if it was supposed to be an adjacent room without flipping another tile. No, it actually specifically oh, it does, does say. Uh, but I do get to heal one, and we're going to add one more ghost. Because I found a second ghost room. Bloop. Yeah, rooms are what rooms are connected by a tunnel. Are you done yet? Uh, loopy. So, yes, adjacent is just means connected by the lines no matter which way. Not that it mattered in this situation, but I could have even moved... Using just a regular movement. You done? Yes, I'm done. Sorry. Because I can move opposite the arrow. Um, but adjacent is adjacent regardless of which way the arrow is pointing. All right. Well, I don't have anything bad. I've got Swindle. Oh, we've run out of space. You can play him up here if you want to show him. Swindle for three coins, please. That, see, that card's really been paying off for you. Well, I mean, every time I play it, anyway. Yep. Um, and then I've got these for one movement and five purchase and two attack. 
Um, let's see. My movement. We've got a secret chest over here. Oh, did you reveal another dragon? You did reveal another dragon card, David. Of course. <laughs> Thank you. I'm not really... I wasn't looking. I should be looking at the cards. You should. <laughs> we'll see. Maybe we'll get one by the end. So the yellow takes a damage. Yeah. And then the white makes us both take a damage and it goes back into the... No, it goes back into the draw pile. Mm. So I'm in trouble. Black cube coming at you. I'm in real... I gotta... Maybe I should have taken that seven artifact. So now I'm going, right? Yep. All right. Uh, one movement. I will move into... Is that a major or minor or what? That's a major secret if you right. unlock that. I will use my lock pick on the major secret. Sorry, I'm not... There you go. A whopping five points. I guess I don't have to reveal that, do I? No, I guess not. Um, or maybe I do. I'm not sure. Um, and then I've got five purchase power and two attack. I will attack the goblin for a coin. Yep. And then I've got five purchase power. Oh, that's a lot. It is not nothing. Um... Oh, did you put your extra damage out for that white cube that we drew? Uh, I don't know. That I See, the, that's why we have the chat. That's why we do it live. Yeah, this is, this is, we're all participating in this game. Jester, I completely agree with Jester's comment that the modular board adds a lot to this game. I mean, it really does. It just, even though you're seeing maybe some of the same tiles you've seen before, the way that they're coming out when is so different. That was at the beginning of the game. Oh, it's That's been, been there this whole time. time. We've never... Really? We've never taken it. All right. Uh, hmm. I'm going to take the Thieves Shrine and the Rebel Scribe. <coughs> All right. So let's see what we got. It might be dragons. I feel like there's a lot of dragon attacks this no game dragon. so far. No dragon. All right, I see that. Dragon. dragon. The Warden. Danger. Pull plus one cube for dragon attack. So you're going to be pulling four. Is that as long as he's out? As long as he's out. One, two, three. Oh my gosh. And four. I'm so these in are, these bad are shape. Out? Yeah, we're both we're in both pretty in bad, bad shape. shape. We're both equally We're both equally. But you're in, in the purple. Shape. If you die in the purple, you survive kind of like being above the line and clank. I'm in the four. depths, so I will not survive. I need one more card. All right, I'm going to go. I'm going to play the charlatan, discard a card to draw two cards. So let's get rid of the stumble to draw two. Um, I need to mark it here. I have another stumble, so plus one clank up there. I have three attacks, so I could defeat that warden. If you have a crown, teleport to an adjacent room. I don't have a crown, and I don't know that I'm going to get a crown. Where's the market? All the way over there. And all the markets I mean, are like... Is, there are markets. I didn't draw a single move, so I guess I'm not moving in this turn. So I'm definitely not getting a crown. Um, let's go ahead and replace a card in the dungeon row with traps. Let's get rid of the uh, other remove traps. You're removing... Replacing it. You're removing the remove traps? Yeah, to get a new card out. Why in wait? If you're in a crystal cave, minus two clink. You may put this on the top of your deck. Oh, that seems really good. Uh, if you have a crown, teleport to an adjacent room. I don't, so I don't get to do that. So I just have one, two, three, four, five to buy with. Um, okay, so I can definitely buy that Lion Weight. I'll attack the Warden and kill the Warden for three. So I can only defeat him in the depths, which I'm in the depths. So free, the free Warden. Free two prisoners. Yep, so I get to free two prisoners. One point for every prisoner I freed and uh, another Dragon Egg. So the Dragon gets angry and uh, it's worth three points at the end. Also, you should... Okay. Sure, what? Have you kept track of what ones you've used and what ones? I mean, you use them all when you get them. Oh, you do? Well, some of them are like points at the end of the game. So. You don't uh, have to use that when you get it, do you? Well, you do. I oh. think, yeah. Oh. I looked, that's why I wanted to have this. 
I have this little sheet. There's a little cheat sheet. A cheat sheet. Uh, do you have more options to trash or more cards? I mean, there are a lot of cards that actually do let you trash. We're just not finding them. I wouldn't so. say you have more or less than in other client games. The same amount? It just feels like there's not like a lot. So I've got five. Let's get the lion, wait for three. And it goes, this says it can go right on top of my deck. Yeah. And I think that's... The mercenary? No, I don't think I want anything else. Okay. I think I'm good. I'm no dragon. Hoping there's no dragon attack at all here. No dragon. Arrive. All players get plus one clank. Here, add that other one up there. I should have two in there. Well, all maybe right. I should have just got, been happy with that seven. I've got two stumbles for two more clank. I like that. We're going to die, right? <laughs> we might die. This is going to be bad. Um, and then I've just got... This is one of the most boring hands this point in the game. But I've got four purchase and one... Walk. Yeah, uh, these there are some there are a lot of new cards in this deck. There's also some cards you've seen before, like the gems and some cards that were in base versions. clank. I think they even say in the rules that you can use the cards one way or the other. Either you can take these cards back to clank or use some of the cards from other clank expansions and mix them in uh, with this version too. If you wanted a bigger deck of cards, I'm gonna take a mercenary and shadow walk. All right, here's fingers crossed that this is not a dragon. Dragon, dragon, no. Good. Waystone. You may trash this to teleport from one waystone to another. There's not another one on the board. There's only one found so far. So far. All right, well, I'm going to lie and wait then. This is what I wanted because it's minus two clank because I'm in a crystal cave. So I get minus two. Uh, if I get at least three treasure this turn, I get to draw a card. I don't think I will. But I have two moves, so I think I'm going to come off this side of the board, David. So I'm going to shift this whole board over so that I can come off this side. All right. This might be the edge of the board as we determine it. There's another market. There's another market and a 10-point artifact, which might tempt me at this point because I'm so close to dying. Uh, so I've got two moves, so I can pay the extra movement. I am going to pick up the 10-point mm. artifact, which is going to make the dragon angry. Uh, that's unfortunate. I have three to attack with. So let's get that skeleton priest for two. So you I get heal. to heal one, and then it, I gain one clank, so you might as well just move it up there. But I'm staving it off. And then my other one combat will be used to just kill a goblin. One combat? Oh, it's two, isn't it? Yeah. I don't have any... Th oh, no. No, no, no. That seems deadly. You're going to let these skeletons run rampant. I've got... F I am. What kind of adventurer are I've you? I've got five to buy with. Uh, I think it's... I'm going to go for this divining rod and hopefully heal myself. We'll see. All right, let's see what we got. We get two more cards. There could be some dragons here. No dragon, another oh. lion wait, and no dragon, expensive taste. Worth five if you have a crown and a gem. Oh, I have I a I gem. I last time I played, maybe. I think I, ha I bought a gem, didn't is I? Is it my turn? Yeah, it is your turn. Um, all right, I'm going to play I guess I didn't. flamboyance and draw a card. Oh, boy. Um... I've got Thieves Shrine. Now, it says use. Does this mean I could just use either of these and I still keep the card, right? Yeah. I'll take two. Oh, cards. no, this was a treasure. It's So the purple ones are one-time use. Oh, so it's... Yeah. So you should just draw a card to replace it. Because when you used it, it would have gone into the discard pile. When Sorry, did I, I didn't use it? Didn't you use it when you bought it? I did not. Oh, well, then use it was now. Was I supposed to? You were. Oh, really? Yep. Oh. But it's okay. You still use it like normal. But draw another card to replace it because it shouldn't have been in your so deck. So I should have two coins. Yeah, here. Two more coins. Unless I wanted to destroy a couple burgles. But I don't. Sorry, I'm, I don't have a... Yes. Um, David bought a gem. I, I thought I bought a gem, but then I realized quartz I don't think I did. My clank by two. So he bought the smoky quartz. draw another card. Yep. I want that rose quartz. And then I actually, I've got I think. 
these or cards here. The, yeah, there's two rose quartz which out. Which are ultimately just going to give me one, two, three, four, five purchase and one move. Yep. I am going to move off the top here. Yeah. Oh boy, another ghost room. So put another ghost gem uh, up there. Oh, that's a complicated one. It is. I'm going to move here. Get that secret tome. Do you have a lockpick left? I do have a lockpick left, but now I'm lockpickless. So that gets you a secret tome, it goes right into your discard pile. And then I had one, two, three, four, you five. You had five to buy with. Purchase. Hmm. Dang it. I have a lot of movement, but I'm stuck by that crystal cave. Where's the other way? There's another one just, down here. Is it just that one? Yeah. Um, I think I'll get the waystone for one. Yep. That seems smart. Um, I don't know if getting a 10 point artifact was smart, but. Oof. And I guess I'll get another explorer. All right. That's it. Dragon. Thirst for adventure worth two for each artifact and each monkey idol you have. You get three move when you acquire it. All this move stuff, but I'm literally stuck by this crystal. So we're pulling four now. Yeah. Oh my gosh, really? Two of them were mine? They would put like glue on mine so they stick to your fingers. Oh, I have a lot of yellow in here. Do you I'm not I don't know if I'm supposed to look, but I did. All right. A lot of yellow. All done? Uh, I'm going to do am. this. Uh, I've got a mercenary. You can kind of see that there. This Rebel Paladin lets me draw a card for having a companion, which I do. So I'll draw a card. And I draw a card if I have an artifact, uh, which I do. So I'm going to draw a card. For having an artifact. Uh, I've got three movement, two more to buy, actually two more, two, three, four, five, six, seven to buy with. If you generate six or more this turn, heal one heart, so I get to heal one. Uh, and I have three movement and I could potentially get, do I have seven? One, two, three, four, five, I could potentially get Three more. All right, I'm going to go down this way, David, with my three movement. Because... Down this yeah, way? Yeah, I don't want to get stuck by that. Uh, yeah, we, sh we, we should see it. Just a little, just a little bit. bit. Looks like we've decided to go down instead of up. I'm literally... There we go. It teleport. That's what I want to see, but I can't get to that. There's no way for me to get to the teleport from here. Oh, yeah, there is, but I'm going to take three damage to do so. Did I have any sword? I did have three swords. What's the teleport do? Let's you teleport to another teleport node, which right now it's just up here. Uh. But I think I'm going to do that. So I've got three to move. I'm going to go one to come all this way. It would take one, two, three hits. And you got it. I've got three swords. Two to move from this portal to this portal. And three is going to put me in here, which I'm out of swords now. So I'll take another damage. I'll get a monkey idol. Uh, and then I will spend my seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven to get thirst for adventure, which gets me three movement. So I'm going to do one to go here. Oh, you get immediately three movement? Immediately acquire it, you get three movement. Oh, nice. So this is going to cost me seven. Um... And I want, what did I want to say? I wanted a crown, right? I have no idea. I think that card wanted me to have a crown. I'm going to buy a crown. I really should buy some health. And then I get two more movements. So I'm going to go this way. Oh, did we... Uh, someone said I needed to add a white cube to the bag for something. To the thing when we got that other ghost tile. Did you not? I thought... Uh, there I should be three ghost cubes in play. I don't know. When you just narrate, Sorry. it doesn't mean anything. Uh, I will use my last lockpick to free these prisoners. Um, I need some healing. Oh, look. And that went, that should have been in the bag, too, probably. Oh, yeah. I get to heal one health from this uh, person. Thank you I for rescued. keeping us honest. All right. I, I'm going to stop there. You're done? 
Yeah. I uh yeah. I'm just hoping there's not a dragon attack here. Riot. Ooh, you get a prisoner when you acquire it. If you have freed three or more prisoners, you may trash a card. There's our trash. Yeah, I have some too. Yeah, portals don't break up your movement, but it costs like one to move into the portal and then out the other side. Um, hmm. Oh, I see what you're saying. But I'm still, yeah, I have extra movement, but I don't want to take another damage. Okay, I've so got I stopped this there. Swindle for three coins. Nice. Um, and then I've got these for two movement. Four purchase power and two Oh, attacks. nice. You need to grab um, an artifact, David. Two movements. Ugh. I know. Do I oh, I used my last lockpick. I don't know if that was smart using my last lockpick there. I'm going to move. Uh, yeah, that card that David has is just, it's just straight up three gold every single time he plays it. That's three victory points if he doesn't spend it. I'm gonna move here. Okay. Oh, it connects right there too. Yeah. Okay, okay. I could do this. Oof, that's really the only thing I want to do. I'm gonna do that. Oh, that messes me up so bad. I should have saved my lockpick. Oh, this is bad news. <laughs> Wait, I have another option. I might be safe. Uh, so my one is into here, and that lets me put a cube in the waypoint. Yep, and get a coin. You got a, quite a stack of victory points over there with I those coins. coins. I have some coins. And I have one more movement. Um, I'm going to go ahead and move here. Yeah, that was, that was a rough placement for me, and everyone. I a coin, right? Yep. Do you have a lockpick? I do not. Oh, can't get I that secret So that's my movement, and I've got two attack. I'll defeat the goblin for a coin. If I had a lockpick, I would actually be okay here. Uh, actually, what? I'll take that. I'm going to defeat the skeleton. For, I live on the well, edge. Well, then you get two coins instead. Yeah. And put a clank out. You are living on the edge. And we're clank. both in the depths right now. This could be clank. bad. I'm going for broke. That really and was an I've evil placement. Four purchase. Um, but I'm not sure. There was no path on this tile that would have helped me. I was hoping to come straight down, and that didn't happen. Four purchase. I'm going to buy this riot card just to screw you up. How does that screw me up? What well, does I it do? I figured you wanted it. It's for the prisoners, and you're uh, of them. Yeah, I do. Um, that's it. All right, let's see what we got for this. New cards. Yep. No dragon, but a crystal Good. compass. Okay. And dragon. Okay, well. Corrupt advisor. I'm, oh, and he pulls one more, so you're pulling five. I may die here, everybody. Because <laughs> there's a lot of yellow in this bag. Yeah, and the purple tiles here are, are what would be considered the above ground. There's the catacombs and then the depths, which is the blue tiles. Here we go. This is yep. tense. Yep. I'm going to pull them. Here's the first three. Oh, my gosh. One, two, three. I could die here too. Not anymore. And then here's the next two. Come on, red. Yep. Oh. oh, David. Oh no. Boom, boom, boom. What happens when I get here? Do I win? Yeah, not, sure. Some version of winning. Oh man, and there's nothing to kill. Is there anything that like teleports me? I just need something at this point. Oh, you don't have to stop in Crystal Caves this turn. All right, I'm not in a Crystal Cave, so I cannot get my minus two clank, which is I don't have any anyway. I've got a deck here now. I've only got one move. So I'm going to move back into this treasure room. I don't have seven gold, though. I've got three. So I will. I have three. So I'll kill that one goblin. And two, three, four, five. Do I want to risk it to get that <coughs> rose quartz? Sure. Let's live dangerously. I'll put two clank in. I mean, <coughs> this could be really bad. Plenty of yellow in the bag. I know, and there's still a lot of black in there too. Are you done? This has not been my luck so far. 
You're done? Yes, I'm done. Next card. Oh no, it's a dragon. This could be it. Is it another dragon? I'm certain this is going to be it. I'm Five more. Well, if it's it for you, then I'm going to be dead soon. And how do we play that <laughs> out? Do, we, do, we, do, we, do you keep playing? Yeah, oh yeah, I get to keep playing until I die or get out. All right. Well, here's the first three. Boom, I'm dead. Wow. And here's two more, or just... Two more, because oh, there's five. Cause... Yep. Oh, you lucked out, man. So you're dead? I mean, that's what it looks like, unless I win a prize. Yeah. Well, let's see if I can make it out. I don't know Died if I can. on the live stream. I think that's a good idea for a shirt. I don't know if I can. I've got one movement, and I can move across these lines, so I will move backwards. Um... Floating Skull says I can teleport to an adjacent room if I have a crown. And I did. I bought that crown specifically for that card. So I'm going to teleport into one of these adjacent rooms. Uh, I'm going to teleport into this adjacent room here. I don't have a lock pick. Oh, look. There would be a 15 artifact up here, David. If we had survived. If I had survived. Plus one clank. So this is where it's going to be really bad. Because... Uh, you died. So one, two, three, four, five. I have five to buy with. Uh, I might as well get this lion way, although it doesn't matter. Actually, I don't even want that. I mean, you I don't want to buy anything. You probably have more points than I do right now. But all is, you need to do is not buy anything and just get out. I might not, because you're going to draw six cubes here. When? On your turn, because you're dead. I think in a two-player game, I think it's six cubes oh let's find out yep six cubes on my turn is it my turn uh it is your turn because i just went let me make sure i don't know if you if you add the clank that's there or not like a normal <laughs> yeah emily... this is gonna be run yep <laughs> put all those in there emily came into this comments just in time for me to die thanks emily i can maybe make it out of this no, I'm not going to make it out of this. Six? Yep. We're both going to die. That's a damage for me. Two. Okay. Oh my gosh, you're really going to put out one at a time? Am I supposed to take mine out? No, keep, keep drawing them. Mine are supposed to be Oh out. yeah. Three. Four. Oh no. Five. Well, you survived anyway. Six. No, I didn't. What do you mean? That's three damage. We both died. That's oh. three damage. Oh. I was oh. one turn away from making it out. The ghost came up behind you. Went, yeah, that ghost boom. killed me. Would I have been able to do it too? Uh, actually, I don't even think I would have been able to make it out anyway. Yeah, you kind of... Well, I would have been able to get only to the crystal cave. I wouldn't have been able to make it to the purple. I was trying so hard to make it to the purple. Oh, man. Oh, We pushed too far. We did we tried push too so, far. We tried so hard. Uh, you know, and I don't remember the old versions of clank feeling like this well they did in, in that respect well not just the reveal but like the tense feeling that this has when it comes down to it and anyone could die this is a very this feels like a more fast-paced game to me i mean clank has that a little bit but the difference between that and this is like you know how many steps you are, are from getting out that's true. you can do the math and you can say okay well if i just get five move then I can... I'm good. Yeah. But we also had a dragon attack almost every single turn. There were a lot of dragon attacks. Thank you for keeping us on. That there was been, a you know what? There crazy would have been far amount. fewer dragon attacks had they not said anything in the comments. That's true. And we probably would have both survived. But like that was a level of dragon attacks I've not... Like literally almost every single round. The likes round. of which the world has never seen. It was a lot. It was like dragon attack, dragon attack. I think more often than not... And Loopy says that you could have solved that by just not buying cards, which towards the end of the game I stopped doing. Like I didn't buy any cards that last round uh, because I didn't want a dragon I, to come. I think you did. No, I didn't. I didn't buy a single card. Oh, you didn't. Or else we would have maybe had two dragon that's attacks. That's true. That's true. Because you were already. We did bring out another dragon here at one point. Yeah. Oh, I didn't know if that was one that we triggered. I thought that was one that killed you. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe, because the Rose Quartz was out for a while. That's true. That is the one that killed me. Oof, rough anyway. times. So we dive. Yeah, we Woo! dived too greedily, Justin says. I mean, it's, it's not, the game is so much died. fun, though. I mean, in a way, you won because you did better. But I'm going to say it was, a, it was a tie, straight up. This, this, was what's, this killed me. Like I, I should have never... 
I shouldn't I, have done that. When I track this in BG stats, which I'm doing this year, <laughs> for the first time in three plus years, I am going to put it as a complete tie. Or actually, a it is a tie. We a both had zero points. A complete loss. But they were saying in the, in the that that tile you placed was so evil because. You didn't give me a way out of that that room because I ran yep. out of lock picks. And surprise, surprise, I didn't even mean to do that. But I just wanted to get, I mean, this is the only room I really could get to. It's okay. Part of me, like early on, we got that seven point artifact. And part of me thought about just grabbing that seven point artifact and just going. And I probably, maybe I should, even the five point artifact. I'd say we could add up points, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't you, matter. You can't spend your money when you're dead. And we have, you get zero points when you die no matter what. So, yeah. sorry, David. Uh, no, I'm, I, I, I am rich. In good times and friendship at the table. That's true. <laughs> Getting back to that starting tile is super hard. It is. It's also cool, too, because the when we played this before, the purple tiles come out in different configurations. So you're really trying to navigate. And you can start to use like some of these waypoint things. Yeah, That's the why ones I picked that up that waypoint card. Because I figured, okay, in a pinch, I could jump down here and at least get this. And then I'd be close to the purple. Actually, this isn't even close to the purple. No, I tried to teleport, but there was really nowhere to teleport. I can't see it on the screen. I'm surprised But I tried to teleport. Well, I had to. I was all the way down on the south side of the I map. that's fair. There was really no way I was getting all the way back up. There's, there were so many crystal caves. Uh, so I just teleported. So if you die in the purple area. You're good. You still get your good. points. You still get your points. Okay. But if you die in the blue... Which we both did. The depths, your body is lost forever. Ooh, that's a grim way to describe it. We become the ghosts that then kill future oh, adventurers. I like so, I like that. All right, well, that was it. Thanks for watching. We had a lot of fun. I mean, I still had a blast even though we died. Oh, yeah, absolutely. So, this is a good game. If yeah. you haven't played Clank, try this one. If you've played Clank and you're like, mm, I'm kind of done with Clank, definitely give this one a try yeah. because this one actually made me feel pretty re-energized about the yeah, game. Yeah, for sure. All right, thank you all. And uh, yeah, we'll see you next week. Bye-bye.